So, how do anti-epileptic drugs work? Anti-epileptic drugs it works by dis dispersing into your digestive system and being absorbed into your bloodstream in the hope that that increases your seizure threshold. It is believed that people with epilepsy have a lower seizure threshold and the th seizure occurs when the electrical activity in the brain just gets disrupted. The anti-epileptic drugs hope to dampen that down in the hope that you don't have any more seizures. When starting on medication, doctors generally prescribe low doses, so the level in the bloodstream slowly increases until it reaches what is called a steady state. Steady state is where taking the drug regularly keeps the level in the bloodstream constant. When I first was prescribed medication, it started on a very low dosage and it was gradually increased until the seizures stopped happening. Um, the discussion then was if I suffered any side effects and they were listed, I was to go straight back to, to my GP. Doctors tend to do a process called titration and they um, slowly increase the epilepsy medicines and they do this so that it reduces the amount of side effects that a person might experience. They have actually smaller dosages of tablets so that they can increase the amount at a smaller rate which means there's a less of a chance for you to have the nasty side effects of nausea and sickness and dizziness and things. Um, and it is better not to have to experience those things and be put off that drug forever. Try and make sure that the medication is taken as much as possible at the same time of each and every day. Being a police officer, as I am, there are occasions when I would have to work shift or work extended periods um, for major inquiries and such like. And that caused me to miss taking medication at regular points and at that point I felt my body had almost become used to taking medication at a particular time uh, and would feel withdrawal symptoms, uh, dizziness etc if this was prolonged. So take the medication as much as possible at the same periods throughout the day. I certainly was always keen to take them every 12 hours. Uh, so that was maybe 8 o'clock in the morning and 8 at night and so I knew that there's going to be a similar amount in my bloodstream all the time. I used prompts such as a pill box every day to make sure that I'd had my medication and I could see straight away whether I'd had it or not. It's important to, get, to keep your drug level was at a steady level so it's too important to take your medication regularly. You need to keep your medication at a steady level so it's therapeutic. Um, if it's not therapeutic then the chance of having breakthrough seizures are very high. Taking the medication at regular intervals is important as missing doses or stopping the drug suddenly causes the level in the blood to drop very abruptly. This can cause sudden, prolonged or repeated seizures. If you have um, breakthrough seizures abruptly, it can then go on to something like status epilepticus, which is um, where you have one seizure after another, which usually results in emergency admissions to hospital. Also, if this occurs, then you're back at stage one again for things like having um, uh, driving licences revoked and um, some people will even think that oh well I haven't taken my medication for a day and I haven't had a seizure. That doesn't mean to say that your epilepsy has gone away, you've just been very lucky not to have a seizure. When starting on an anti-epileptic drug for the first time, some people experience side effects which can wear off with time. As I've been weaned off and weaned on to the other drug and my body's gotten used to the new drug, the dizziness has faded away after a week or two. It does take that time and that's why my dosage has been increased incrementally, but thereafter the side effect has subsided. The majority of people with epilepsy uh, get control of their seizures use, uh, with, with just one medication, but for certain types of epilepsy, more difficult to treat epilepsies, sometimes people uh, need to have a second medication. This is usually introduced um, uh, slowly along with uh, the maintenance of the dose of the first medicine.